debate uh, tonight. Mohan Vishwa, spokesperson of uh, the BJP in Karnataka, also joining the debate. Ishkaran Bhandari, advocate in the Supreme Court. Brajesh Kalappa, advocate uh, joining uh, from Bengaluru. And uh, uh, Tessin Poonawala, uh, Congress supporter, continues to be with us. I want to ask you, Mohan Vishwa, many issues on which the governor uh, has not given clearance, but this is uh, a fast-track clearance coming in. Uh, once again, the Congress party has alleged that uh, politics is playing out in Karnataka. How do you respond to the Congress's charge? Navika, very good evening. See, regarding the charges of Congress, see, they say there is an allegation for prosecution against Mr. Chikala Jolle, who was an ex-minister and sitting MLA. There was one more person named called Mr. Murugesh Nirani. He was an ex-minister and not even an MLA now. And also against S.T. Kumar Samu, is a central heavy industrial minister. So regarding these three people, if you want me to say, they are nowhere connected. As I said, Shifikala Jule is an MLA. And Mr. Nirani is not even an MLA. And when the prosecution, uh, what do you say, uh, the suggestion came to Mr. Governor eight, nine months back, even then Mr. Kumar Samu was not even a MP. He was not even a minister. Come on, why there is a need to get a permission from the governor to investigate something on them? See, this is basically a diversion tactics. So there is a difference between uh, ordering an investigation against chief minister and against an ex-MLA or ex-minister or an MP. So here there is a clear-cut distinction. Who is stopping from them to do investigation against these people? If at all there is something and this government is in power from past 14 months, what they're doing it? They can do it on their own just by giving a complaint to either ACB or 